There's nothing more infuriating than having a dripping tap, and it's not always necessary to replace the tap because we can reseat it. So if we strip the tap down, having turned off the water, obviously, we'd be in a mess if we didn't. We can take out the jumper, and this is the washer we need to replace. But if we're replacing that, we also need to make sure that the brass seat is nice and smooth, and there's good contact between the rubber washer and the brass seat. So to do that, we use a Monument 450P DIY tap receiving tool, which is supplied with a handle and two double-ended bushes and three cutters. So first we need to select the cutter. We need to select the bush that fits into our tap, which is the smaller one here. It's actually supplied with um, bushes for BS1010 taps and BS5412, and it's suitable for reseating half inch and three quarter inch taps. So having established, that's the bush. We need to make sure that our cutter will go through the gap. So we're gonna use the smaller one, which in this case is a 17 millimeter. So we engage that, make sure that's the right one. Pop that on there, screw on the cutter. Insert the cutter into the body, screw in the bush. The bush now ensures that the cutter is perpendicular to the brass seat that we want to cut. Then applying light pressure, we can now reseat the brass. Take that back out. We fitted our new washer. We can now reassemble the tap very easily. There is a small plastic fitting that's supplied with this. The purpose is to stop it rolling off the packaging. However, it's also very good for holding the jumper unit while you're working. And that's now solved our problem of the leaking taps. That's the Monument 450P DIY tap receiving tool.